Following enrichment, the enriched sample is added to the lateral flow device. Liquid drawn up the device picks up the color labeled antibody striped onto the reagent pad. Target pathogens contained in the sample bind to the color labeled antibody. Together, these bind to the antibody on the test line, forming an antibody target pathogen antibody sandwich. Additionally, the color labeled antibody binds to the anti species antibody on the control line. This control reaction occurs regardless of the target pathogen's presence or absence to assure you the test is working correctly. So, in the case of a positive result, you'll see two lines form. Any development, regardless of intensity, is considered a line. Liquid drawn up the device picks up the color labeled antibody striped onto the reagent pad. Since the sample doesn't contain the target pathogen, there's nothing for the color labeled antibody to bind to until it reaches the anti-species antibody striped to the control line. That's why, in the case of a negative result, you'll only see the control line develop and no test line in the test zone.